Oh God, never let us take your presence for granted. Yes. 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 Never let us take you for granted. Oh God. Yes. Never let us take all that you do for us for granted. Oh, yes. oh God, we're grateful. We thank you, oh God. We love you, oh God. Yes, God. We appreciate your presence, oh God. We appreciate all that you do, oh God. We appreciate that you are God in our lives, oh God. Yes, God. Oh God, we love you. Yes. Because you love us in spite of our mess, oh God. Yes, God. Yes, God. Yes, God. Yes, God. Yes, yes. Even when we don't do right, oh God. Oh God, we love you. Yes, God. Yes, God. Continue to hold us, continue to mold us, oh God. Continue to graft us in the way you want us to be, oh God. Yes. Oh God, we thank you. Thank you, Jesus. God, at this moment, I ask that you continue to let your presence fill the world. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Yes, God. We go towards the peace word, oh God. I ask that you make us ready, receptive, and responsive to your yes, word, yes, yes. oh God. And let everybody be able to grab something from you and help them in their walk, oh God. For this yes, entire Lord. season, we pray. Amen. 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 I don't know about you, but I don't mind worshiping. Amen. 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 Not at all. I don't mind basking in God's presence. Yes, yes. Yeah. Thank you. If you have your Bible, turn to me to Psalm 105. Psalm 105. Let's see what that one verse, one verse. And don't worry, under the big black thing on the table is not a safe or anything like that, so you can be. Come on. I might do that next time. <laughs> verse 4. 105, verse 4. <clears throat> and it reads, Look to the Lord and his strength. Seek his face always. You may be seated. All right. Look to the Lord and his strength. Seek his face always. One verse, I shouldn't do this for you long. Vantage point. All right. Vantage point. My sister, when she was young, was a bit of a troublemaker. She was always starting stuff with people bigger, stronger, and faster. <laughs> well, and she just had that mouth, and she had to run it. And when she was getting over her head, her skate rope was, well, I'm going to tell my brother. That's right. <laughs> People in the absence of seeing her brother would be unafraid. To them, he is just some guy she is related to. I think we get to the points with God that it's just some God we pray to. Mm. He is just somebody we worship mm. on Sunday. Mm. The people my sister messed with did not understand the relationship. That was my little sister, and it was by default my job That's right. to protect her. That's right. I think when we look at the Lord, we do not understand the relationship. Lord meaning master, Lord meaning ruler, Lord meaning sovereign. When I begin to understand what it means, I will look at the Lord differently. Yeah, we look yeah. at God as some guy. Mm -hmm. Just some pie in the sky idea of who God is, who hands out things every now and then. But when I begin to understand that he's the master and the ruler yeah, of my yeah. life and I'm his servant, mm -hmm. when I look at the relationship differently, and understand, although I'm his servant, he wants what's best for me. Yes, 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 yes. It begins to change the perception mm -hmm. of who the Lord is. All right. We look to the Lord like a suggestion box. Mm -hmm. Let me hear your ideas, and I'll run them by my people, and we'll see what we come up with. Yeah. <laughs> for far too many of us, the voice of God is no longer the compass of our lives. Mm -hmm. We talked in Bible study about how the voice of God moved Abraham, and it moved Noah. We hear the voice of God today, and we've come up and we we stop moving on what he says. Mm -hmm. God speaks and we ignore. Mm -hmm. God speaks and we say, I hate, but that's not what I want to do. Mm -hmm. How can we be believers and God's voice doesn't move? All right. All right. All right. How can we be the children of God and his voice doesn't move? I don't know about you, but when my father says something, you move. Yeah. You move, you yeah. move. Yeah. You're better, you're better, you're better. Yeah. Ignore God and God speaks and well, I don't feel like it. We have to get back to where the voice of God was everything. Uh -huh. yeah. It was what we waited for. We didn't move without the voice of God. Right. We didn't make a decision without hearing God speak. We cannot continue to be content being led by outside sources. All right. Everything outside of our relationship with God is what leads us. Uh -huh. The stock market, 
TV, the news, the newspaper, the internet, what's the latest trend, what's the latest pyramid scheme? We're trying to follow all of that and not hearing what God has for us. All right. All right. So when my sister would get out of school, I would go to her school's playground to get her, and her problems would go away because they saw my size. Uh -huh. <laughs> there would be a realization that this is a battle I do not want. <laughs> The verse says to seek God and his strength. Uh -huh, uh -huh. I think sometimes we devalue how powerful our God is. Well, yeah. Our struggles do not mean God is weak, but that's what we equate it to. Mm -hmm. Our depleted finances do not mean God is insufficient, but that's what we equate it to. Right. Our poor health leads us to believe that God is no longer in the healing business. All right. How is it that we claim to know God and who he is and all he's capable of, yet our actions say we have no faith in him. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. We stop believing that God can use the supernatural. Uh -huh. Yeah. The, the yeah. tangible and what we, but the supernatural just doesn't exist for the uh -huh. believer anymore. How, uh -huh. The believer doesn't believe that the supernatural God they serve has supernatural power. All right, all right. right. Come on, preacher, come on. But we say we believe mm -hmm. in God. Mm -hmm. Yeah. When problems come, all we see is the problem. Mm -hmm. It's not every problem, only in the areas we struggle. Mm -hmm. Watch, when Mary came to Jesus for one, Jesus never said yes, but she knew he would do it and could do it, so it wasn't an issue. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. But when Lazarus died, things was different. Yeah. Uh -huh. Because that was the difference. My brother is gone, and her and her sister was tripping, and they didn't have faith that he could do it. And if Jesus, if you hadn't been here, my brother wouldn't have died. That's right. It that's was right. a different situation, and that's what we do. Right. We too act this way. There are things we don't fret over. Some of us don't trip over money. Mm -hmm. Some of us don't trip over our health. Mm -hmm. But then if something happened to our children, My if something happened to our spouse, yeah. Yeah. all of a sudden we can't handle it. All right. Right. God right. can't do that thing. Uh -huh. hmm. uh, you're not sure whether he'll bring you out this time. Don't look at the problem. Look at him and his strength. All yeah, right. This yeah. world is a results business and we want to quit huh. in the process. Huh. How do I know it's just a process because God hasn't said it's over. All right. Yeah, right. Yeah, so yeah. We, we looking at it right now and it's like, well, it's not, it's not possible. Mm -hmm. And the problem is what trips us up. Uh -huh. We see the prop, watch. The problem is what trips us up. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. This is all drink. Mm -hmm. All drink. Uh -huh. Can you see that? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. We know that's water, mm -hmm. or you hope that's water. <laughs> and that's something, mm -hmm. and that's something else. Mm -hmm. All coming from water. Mm -hmm. God tells you your healing is in this one. All right. Mm -hmm. All you see is the color. Mm -hmm. You trip over the color. Well, uh -huh. You say, well, this one don't look that bad. Well, well. Can I do this one? Uh -huh. You start negotiating, but your healing uh, is in this one. All right. But God, I, this one don't, what about this one? I can see straight. But your healing uh -huh. is in uh -huh. this one. All right. yeah. And we ignore this one uh -huh. because we look at the color. And so we stop looking at God. My, all my, I'm my. focused on is wow. the color of this glass. Uh -huh. yeah. All I'm focused on is what's in here. Now, what you don't know is that this is water, but it has a poison in it that you can't see. Well, well, I'm sure. uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But all you see okay. is that it's clear. Yeah. Uh -huh. And what you don't know is this is water out in faucet. And if you're looking like that, Lord knows you don't want to drink. Uh -huh. But this right here is water out the Jordan. Uh -huh. And the water out the yeah. Jordan has some healing yes, power. Yeah. And if you just trust God enough uh -huh. to drink the water out uh, uh -huh. yeah. the Situation and yeah. it takes all your focus right, right. off of who's telling you <laughs> what to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Has yeah. he ever led you astray before? Mm. Has he ever led you to a position that you couldn't get out of before? Mm. We got to begin to trust God on a supernatural yeah. level. Yeah, yeah, See yeah. God and his face. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. Uh, and it's not his hand, but his face. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Not what's in his wallet, but his face. Mm -hmm. God, I'm seeking you just because of who you are. Mm -hmm. Now, we talked about earlier, if you understand who he is, you'll just, you'll just see. You'll just go forth and say, God, I, I want to be in your presence. Mm -hmm. And as you get in your Christian walk, your vantage point will begin to change. This is why we struggle. When you get saved, your vantage point initially is like that baby. Mm -hmm. ha. And everything God is saying is no. Mm -hmm. And why is God telling me no? Because I'm not ready for it. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. That's right. No, you can't do this. No, that baby thinks she can walk. If you put it down, yeah. she can try to walk. She yeah. can bust her face. Yeah. So we say no okay. a lot, uh -huh. but it's for your own protection. Right. And so our vantage point needs to be: God don't ever let me do what I want to do. Uh -huh. Now understand, He's protecting you right. from you. Well, yeah. All right, all right. Uh -huh. yeah. And then when you get bigger and you start doing stuff and you think you grow. And it, again, God says, I let you do all this, but you're not ready for that. And your vantage point in your relationship has changed. Ask yourself this question. As long as I've been saved, has my vantage point of God changed? My, my. Do I still look at God the same way as when I quoted Romans 10 and 9 and they took me in that back room and it was hot and they said, if you believe, you'll be saved and you'll go with God to heaven. Has your vantage point of the Christ changed? Uh -huh. Because see, as I grow, I often experience new things. Yes, yes sir. When I experience some new stuff, I should see God differently. Mm -hmm. Right. If you got a spouse, you shouldn't see your spouse the same way you saw them when you first. Amen. Well, Amen. Yeah, yeah. I hope you grew to love them differently, uh -huh. yeah. stronger, yeah. and better. Yes, sir. And you understand that it should be the same way with God. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But we stop seeking them after we meet. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. We treat God like every other relationship. Yeah. Okay, now I got you. Mm -hmm. And I don't do anything special anymore. Mm -hmm. I don't acknowledge you the way I used to. I don't spend time with you the way I used to. Mm -hmm. And it dissolves just the way an earthly relationship would. Mm -hmm. And so all of a sudden, you're out on your own. You see, how did I get here? Mm -hmm. I started ignoring the love of my life. Mm -hmm. What happens when you ignore the love yeah. of your life? Yeah. If you ignore your spouse for too long, what's gonna happen? Mm -hmm. Well, if you ignore your children for too long, well, what's gonna happen? Okay. Somebody's gonna replace you. In that's this. right. That's okay. right. And what happens is we ignore God so long, we start putting other stuff in headship. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. So your yeah. job takes position. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, working out takes position. Having fun with your boys or your girls takes position because mm -hmm. we stop seeking God's face. Mm -hmm. yeah. This text is written by David. Um, it's recorded also in 2 Chronicles chapter 16. All right. And it's David telling the people how God ain't forgot about them. Mm -hmm. How God had blessed them through the past. You keep going to touch my, my anointing and do my prophets no harm because mm -hmm. we're protected by God. And if you mess with us, he, he. Oh, yes, sir. Some of y'all don't believe that. that if, yeah. if I'm God's property and somebody mess with me, yeah. there's yeah. consequences. Come on. Yeah. Right. Yeah. I'm, I'm yeah. going to tell you. Right. If you mess with God's people, yeah. come on. Yeah. Maybe God ain't God's people. But uh, if you mess well, with me, there's some consequences from Him. Yes. And I don't even have to yes. deal with you. Yes. God bless you, brother, because God touched not my own uh, yeah. and do my prophets. Yeah. No harm. David is encouraging the people that. Through this time of transition, God has still kept us. God has still watched over us. Watch this. Through this time of transition, God has still kept us. God has still watched us. God is still with us. Yeah. Do you still believe? Mm -hmm. Are you still seeking? Mm -hmm. Are you seeking his hand on his face? I saw something this morning, and it was a tweet, and it was from um, a publisher, and she was like, there's no quick way, no easy way to make money. No, and, and that's what we do. We go to God for eat. Mm -hmm. God, I want the perfect, easy relationship. Mm -hmm. I want to walk in the store and he speak to me. He had the money, the house, the food, and everything, and I know it's here because it's going to be exactly how I ask for it, God. That's how we do I, I, I don't want to go through nothing. I don't want to go through it, It's just him. And I know because he's going to be in my favorite Walmart right there, and I know. <laughs> we do that with y'all. I want to go, God. I don't even want to ask them dumb interview questions. They can see me. We can laugh. And I, I'm going to get the job. And I'm going to know it's you because it's going to be easy. God, I want to get rich. And I want to do this get rich quick scheme. And uh -huh. you're going to bless it. You're going to touch it. And I know it's you because you won't blow up. We want to avoid work in every area. Well, my, 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 my. We want to avoid work in parenting. We want to avoid work in our relationship. We want to avoid work at work. Why are they bothering me? Why they keep looking over here and saying, leave me alone? Come on, man. Right, right. We want right. to avoid work at all costs. We want to go to the gym and get fit because we was in the gym. Yeah. yeah. And there was sweat yeah. around us. Yeah. 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 And, and we, we want to right. get the residual of somebody else's. That's what we, we want to get the residual of you doing the work. See? Lord, have mercy. We try to catch on the tails of other people because y'all doing the work. And you know, I, I put this little bit of money to it and I want some dividends. Huh. We don't want to do actual work. Right. 
Right. Are you willing to do the work to see Ooh. God's face? Not mine. Not mine. Are you willing to do the work to stay in God's presence? Yeah. yeah. Are, are you willing to do the work to stay in God's will? Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Mm. Are you willing to deny yourself to be in the will of my, God? My, my. It's all about values. How are you looking at this thing? Yeah. How? What, what do you do? You see it as I'm giving up everything I want, or I'm getting everything I'm supposed to have. My, mm. my. That changes everything. If I look at it as I'm getting everything I'm supposed to have, it's going to motivate me, it's going to light a fire uh -huh. behind me. But if I look at it as I'm giving of everything I want, I'm never going to do it. Mm -hmm. I'm never going to do it. Mm -hmm. it that, that's in anything. Motivation is everything in whatever you do. Mm -hmm. You got to be motivated to eat. Because see, you can be hungry and not want to eat all day. Yeah. 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 I'm telling you, I'm a new level of lazy yeah. when I want to be. I can be hungry. Yes. And not feel like getting up to get the food. Yes, yeah, right. Maybe, okay. And so you got to be motivated to do. You got to be motivated to go to the bathroom. Mm. I don't want to miss this next scene on this show right here. So I'm gonna sit here and hold my bladder because I might miss this next scene. Motivation. Yeah. When you get old, it'll change. Uh -huh. <laughs> Motivation. Yeah. What's your motivation for seeking God's face? Mm -hmm. Yeah, amen. What's your, what's your motivation for seeking mm -hmm. Him where He is? Mm -hmm. Vantage points. This, this yeah. is all about how you see, how are you seeing things? Yes. Mm -hmm. How are you seeing the Christ? Because the half our problem, half of us still see Him as baby Jesus. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we still well. got Him in the mangers. Right. <laughs> and it is my dear sweet baby Jesus. We still got Him. In the manger, we still all he cute and the wise men with him. And that picture hung anyway, because it's two years before they got there, but I'm gonna leave that alone. Okay. I'm saying we still got a name. Uh -huh. Or we got bearded, blue-eyed, long-haired Jesus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We don't want to deal with cross, beat up, bludgeon, can't recognize his face, Jesus. Mm -hmm. Let alone the afterwards. The resurrected, all powerful mm -hmm. Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What's one that what, what are we looking to? To see, I'm looking to the one that's sitting at the right hand of the Father. My, my. Yeah. 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 That's, that's the one I'm looking to. I'm grateful for all he did because all he did got me here. Yeah. But I thank God for his intercession right now. Yeah. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. 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 See, God don't do it. I know they hard headed as a Jezebel, but please don't yeah. do it. Hold on. One more game, one more game, one more game. <laughs> and I thank God for the one more game because Lord knows I need yes, sir. Right, yes, sir. Right, yes, right, yes. Yes. seek his face. Yeah. God bless you. Amen. 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 Seeking his face just then on Sunday is all, all the time. 